We can also use SPCC to enhance H-alpha structures in a galaxy image. On the left, we have an image of M81 and M82 that has already been calibrated with SPCC. Now we're going to add this image taken with an H-alpha filter. To do this, we open Channel Combination and put the H-alpha image in the R channel and disable the G and B channels. And we apply the process to the color image. The result is very poor. This is because all the objects are much weaker in H-alpha and the sky background in this channel is also very dark. But if we apply SPCC again, we can create an image where we enhance the hydrogen structures while also preserving the broadband colors. In this image, the nebulas in the spiral arms of M81 have been enhanced, as have the hydrogen jets in M82. In fact, they've been enhanced so much that we're going to have to control the intensity of the process. The color saturation in these nebulas is very high in comparison with the rest of the image. This will pose a problem when we come to adjust the color intensity globally, as the nebulas will become saturated. Let's undo the two processes. Now we're going to add the H-alpha to the color image in a controlled way using pixel math. First, we need to uncheck this checkbox so that we can add a formula in each primary color channel. The formula for blue and green is simply $t, which is a wildcard meaning target image. In other words, we're not modifying these color channels. We're keeping the originals. In the R channel, however, we're going to put the target image multiplied by a factor, plus the H-alpha image also multiplied by a factor. If both factors are 0.5, we'll be mixing 50% of the red channel and 50% of the H-alpha image. If we type 0.3 in the red channel and 0.7 in the H-alpha, we'll be giving more weight to the hydrogen image. In this image, a factor of 0.5 works very well. Now we apply the process and calibrate the image again. And we reapply the auto stretch. Lastly, we're going to delinearize using histograms. As always, we disable the STF, and now we increase the color saturation using curves. And here's the result. The spiral arms are full of nebulas and young stars. And here's M82 with its H-alpha jets. I walk up the river by my sun Feet step over splinters of the moon Golden, golden thing.